Hey guys, Leanne here on Grady's Mom with a grocery haul. I was actually planning to go to Trader Joe's, but it's been really rainy here and the roads were really flooded and it's a pretty much too far of a drive uh, to make it out there today. So I just went to my local Publix and I'm planning on going to Trader Joe's later in the week for a big stock up. Um, so I'll show you guys what I picked up at Publix. I got a gallon of water for the Keurig some veggies to make a few meals to get me through until I can get to Trader Joe's. I got some broccoli, a couple tomatoes, a cucumber, a big thing of the white mushrooms. I'm going to do my white turkey goulash this week, some bananas for smoothies, a couple large sweet potatoes for a recipe as a side dish, the zucchini um, also for the white turkey goulash. I got a couple of the lean cuisine. These are the Thai style spring rolls. I really like having these for lunch. So these are just for the freezer, a couple things of Elio's Pizza. One will go in the garage freezer and one will go in the house freezer. Brady likes these and we have these for lunch sometimes. Some ground beef for chili this week. Some ground turkey for the white turkey goulash this week. I got some pantry things. The paste salsa was buy one get one. So I got some original recipe as well as the uh, picante mild sauce. I got some of the Pillsbury Crescent Rolls to make as a side this week, some jumbo eggs, just a dozen of those, some of the Newman's marinara. When I go to Trader Joe's, I'm going to stock up on the Trader Joe's marinara because I actually prefer that, but this is really good also. I got some organic Hans tomato sauce in the can. I usually use a can of, these, a can of this for um, with, when I make chili, so I got a couple of these. Uh, the other one is right here. I got some kidney beans for the chili. I got a small little tiny baby can of SpaghettiOs to see if Grady will eat these as a lunch option since he's on Christmas break. Got some white corn to throw in the chili. I'm also going to throw in some black beans, I think. I got some of the big slice in the jar. I've usually only seen these in the pouches, but um, I've tried this kind cinnamon French toast in the little packet. And I was really happy to see this in the jar. This is an expensive product. This jar was about five bucks, but it's an absolute treat. They're super delicious, all natural. And these are just the kettle cooked apples. Um, and there's just, they're just sliced and chunky sort of applesauce style. Again, in the cinnamon French toast flavor, they had a couple other flavors too, but I really like this one. Some yogurt for Grady, the strawberry Ninja Turtle. Got a big thing of celery. Some of my favorite bread, which is the Publix White Mountain Bread. Um, this does have a short shelf life, but it doesn't really last too long in our house. Um, so this should be gone in the next couple days. It's really, really good bread for French toast and sandwiches. Excellent bread. Got a beef broth for the chili, a chicken broth for the white turkey goulash. Um, I got some elbow noodles for the chili. I got a few packs of these North Sides, which I really like. Cheddar broccoli, taco rice, and Spanish rice. I'm going to do quesadillas one night, so I'll make the Spanish or the taco rice. And these are a really great deal. I've talked about these before for a dollar. They're super easy, and they're even good to make for yourself for a quick lunch while your kids are at school. Um, and I just think they're a really good deal for a dollar. Some Tostitos corn chips. Some of the Smart Food brand movie theater butter. I love this brand. I usually get the white cheddar. But I decided to try this one. I'm not sure how buttery it's going to be, but I know the Smart Food makes a really good popcorn in general. This is everything I purchased. Again, this is just to get me over until I can do a larger haul at Trader Joe's, which I will film for you guys later in the week. I will also show you my meal plan after this, so hope you guys are having a great day. Okay, so the meal plan for the week. Oh, we're going to have chili in the crock pot. I'm going to add some black beans and corn to that, along with some cornbread. And then a different night, I'm going to do the white turkey goulash in the crock pot, and I'll just probably do a Caesar salad or a tossed salad on the side. I gave myself a night for leftovers or breakfast because these two things especially make a lot. So chances are it'll be leftovers rather than breakfast. One night we're going to do chicken quesadillas with some Spanish rice, and I'll probably just do like some sliced up tomato or cucumber on the side with some balsamic. One night we're going to do roast pork loin with sweet potatoes. I do the sweet potatoes cubed up with butter and brown sugar and marshmallows and bake them in the oven. They're really good. And I'll do some steamed broccoli on the side. One night I'm going to make my creamy chicken and wild rice soup, which I did do a cooking video for a while back. 
as well as some of the Pillsbury Crescent Rolls. So that'll be easy. And then one night we're going to be going out for New Year's dinner with friends. So I will have to cook that night, which is really nice. So I hope you guys enjoy the meal plan for the week. Have a great day, and I will see you guys very soon. Bye.